Hey guys, today's video is actually a little bit from yesterday and a bit from today. Uh, I just didn't have enough yesterday to release a whole video, so we added it on at the beginning here. I'll put timestamps in so you know which is which, and let's go take a look. There's a park police mounted unit, and there's a horse. He's out patrolling the mall, just down below the U.S. Capitol, which is behind those trees. Over there's a little kid been screaming, horsey, horsey. He wants to come over and see the horse. I think the horse is going back into the trailer. This is what's colloquially called a bicycle rack. This is a uh, pedestrian control measure. These were the only fences that they had up on January 6th. And as you can imagine, they were quickly, quickly dispatched. So we can't go up to the landing. There's a bunch of cops up there. Probably got a dog up there too. But I think we can use this staircase to go over the railing and get a better view from the grassy area which is, well, muddy, I think. Actually, it's not that bad. That's where the Christmas tree was. Big footmarks. And here is the Capitol. There we go. Better look at what's going on. Let's zoom in. Let's zoom in a little more. Big fences. They got a they got some wiring running across the top, some cables going from one side to the other. Doors are closed today. In the past we've seen them open. I can hear some drilling going on over here. Sanding, drilling. The Senate's in session at the moment. That's why the flag's up. In fact, the house is also in session. Let's go. Time to sweep away all the salt and sand so that they can reapply it this weekend when it sleets. <laughs> yeah. They are sweeping up over there. The Senate steps. These are all the leadership cars. I learned when there's two of them together, that's a leadership team. If it's just one, it's a senator. But if there's like two, like this is two, that's two, then it's a leadership. There's a couple over there as well. I tell you guys, black suburbans, black suburbans run the country. <laughs> or Yukons. No, actually, everything I see is a suburban, a Chevy suburban. Blue sky today. Black suburbans all around the Senate. And a lot up there. And then I think over here on the house, they've got a few suburbans too. Yeah, sometimes I'm in a hurry. Yep, we're just getting a sub today. Jimmy John's bootlegger. Some of you might not know this, but I actually grew up in the town where Jimmy John's was started. In fact, John, the guy, actually used to make subs for me when I was a teenager. And the original Jimmy John's owner, who I guess he just recently cashed out as a very successful billionaire. Hmm. 
So Biden just finished his remarks. They're busy shutting down the road down here at Constitution and 14th for his motorcade to return. This goes on for pretty much every motorcade. They, they shut down everything. Whole intersection is blocked and everybody is rerouted. So this is Constitution Avenue, completely closed. From 15th Street all the way up to the Capitol. Now the scouts are out checking the route. And here come the first of the scouts. Big motorcade. Hey guys, it is a warm and blustery day. It's about, uh, it's in the 40s going up to the 50s they say, but it's raining everywhere, it's wet damp and it's going to rain for the next two days <laughs> kind of blows we just saw a motorcade uh, that was uh, biden's motorcade coming back from the u.s capitol the vice president's motorcade is going to go down um, i think the other side of the mall they usually travel in traffic so it's harder to track in fact i hear sirens right now that could be them uh biden is off to new york today we don't know if he's going to take a helicopter like marine one's going to come in don't think so because of the weather but hey let's take a look maybe we'll get lucky Vice President's motorcade is arriving up there. I'm not going to be in position in time. It's coming in on the North Pennsylvania Avenue entrance. You can see there we go is the police car escort. There, the Secret Service. And there is the Vice President's two Suburbans pulling into the White House. All right, let's go turn around and head back out on our adventure today. So a man who was arrested uh, back in October for parking his truck in front of the Supreme Court and scaring the Capitol Police and all that, he's back. He's back at the Supreme Court right now. Uh, police have surrounded his vehicle. They shut down the roads. Let's go see. So we're on our way up to Capitol Hill. Stuck at a red light. Hopefully they won't barricade off the hill. They do that a lot. They pop up the barriers and nobody can get up there, but we'll see. That was, bizarre. that was bizarre. They just let him drive off. So I raced up to Capitol Hill to see the guy get released. <laughs> the police just said, go away. And well, he did. And that was pretty much the end of it. So we're at a gas station. It's $3.37 a gallon. And well, we're trapped. Yeah, the police have blocked off access because you see the big thing over there. That's Andrews Air Force Base. To it, and the motorcade is coming.
<laughs> I heard Air Force One, but it took off to the south today and I'm at the north runway. There's nowhere to get to the south runway. So he's up in the clouds, say la vie. Ah, oh, guys, yeah. Welcome to the beach house. This is only about an hour outside of Washington. I mean, it's 35 miles or something as the crow flies, but it takes me about an hour to get here, especially when I'm at Andrews Air Force Base, though, it's a lot easier. I just came out to run a few errands, grab some lunch, and then we'll get back into the city this afternoon. Sometimes it's just peaceful. Ah, old reliable. Pizza. Pretty foggy day out here today. The ice on the river is creating a fog as the temperatures reach up into the 50s, but there's a lot of rain. So guys, I'm on the side of the Potomac and I have a new toy today. Ta-da! Look at that. This is a 600 millimeter lens. I got it to take pictures of Marine One. Uh, I rented it, I didn't buy it yet. Uh, anyway, it's raining, there's no Marine One. <laughs> Let's go take pictures of birds. Here you can see all the ice on the tidal basin looking over to the Jefferson. It's pretty wet and pretty cold. Sorry, I don't have any money, man, but here's some gloves. Yep. So guys, that was today. Uh, tomorrow we have, well, we should have Marine One operations. Hopefully we'll see them if the weather cooperates, though. It's not looking good at the moment. Anyway, subscribe if you haven't. Uh, I will see you again soon. Thanks for watching. Good night.